Hey guys, it's Erin. I'm back and I'm gonna do Juice World, everybody's favorite. It seems like I get a lot of views on my Juice World, so you know, you stick with what does well, you know. I actually cannot believe that I did not do a reaction to this one. Um, I do know of it, obviously. It's like one of Eminem's biggest one, but it features Juice World. Um, so it's Godzilla. And I do know that this is the one where like Eminem raps really, really fast. But I had to actually go check my content yesterday because I could not believe that I did not do a reaction to this. I don't know how this one slipped like from when I used to do them before. But anyway, so there is a video for this, but I have this feeling that if I do the video, um, I'm, it's going to get completely blocked. Um, when it's completely blocked, it doesn't even let me just post it even without making money. It doesn't even post it. When it's partially blocked, which I'm hoping that's all this will be, is it just means it can't play in Russia and Ukraine or something like that, and I can't be monetized. I don't really care about it being monetized. These are the bigger videos. These are the ones that are getting views, um, people coming to my channel, so which makes them look at other stuff that is monetized. So we're not really worried about the money. I'm just really worried about doing this reaction and be able to post it and you guys can get to see it. So fingers crossed I do this one and it's all good and I can post it. But I did the lyrics because there's a better chance of it not being blocked if it's only the music and not also the video. So um, there's been ones on Eminem that has been completely blocked. So I'm worried because this is one of his biggest ones. So Eminem featuring Juice World, Godzilla. And guys, I'm a little nervous because I know that this one goes really fast. And like, that's why I'm so happy I have the lyrics. And I will be pausing just to like, let you know. Okay. All right, here we go. I can swallow a bottle of alcohol and I feel like Godzilla. Better hit the deck like a cartilla. My whole squad's in here walking around the party across between a zombie and a pop. There's so much that's being said. I, I caught the card dealer, like hit the deck like a card dealer. Um, here, sh she's in the bitch. I'm posse up. Consider it to cross me a costly mistake. If they sleep it on me, the girls better get insomnia, ADHD, and hydroxy cut. If anybody doesn't know what hydroxy cut is, hydroxy cut was is I think it's still on the market. It's been out for like probably 25 years, and it's basically a pill that you can actually get in America. You can get it at Walmart. It's over the counter. It's not a prescription, but it basically makes you really, really hyper, and you end up losing weight. They say it's, you know, a weight loss pill, you know, like it, it's a supplement to help you lose weight. But what it actually really does is just makes you like so much energy and like you actually feel heart racing because I actually did try it one time when, not when it first came out, obviously, but like, I don't know, I was probably like 20 something and I was like, let me try it, you know, and it, my heart raced. So stay away from hydroxycut. I can't believe they're still trying to sell that stuff because it really, it has, people have had heart attacks with it. It's not good. Just do it the normal way. Cut back on your food and walk. Or that's what I did. Five miles a day and cut back my food. All right. No hydroxy cut. Let's get back to it. ADHD hydroxy cut. That's the capacity. Hey, hey. In AA with an AK melee. Finish at it like a play date. Better vacate. Retreat like a vacay mayday. This beat is cray cray. Ray J. H. A. H. A. Wait. There's some stuff going on there. Pass the Karasi. I think that's alcohol. In AA. Oh, Alcoholic Nom Anonymous with an AK. In AA with an AK. Mele. Finna set it like a play date. So he's in AA. Alcohol Anonymous with an AK gun. Better vacate. Retreat like a vacay. This beat is cray cray. Ray J. Okay. Better vacate, retreat, like a vacay, mayday. That's like army stuff right there. Um, retreat and mayday. And now he's talking about Ray J. Ray J is a... Uh, he's somebody's sister. And like, isn't he the famous one for... 
like some kind of tape. Is that with the one with Kim Kardashian? Or somebody? I, I guess he has beef with RJ. This beat is Craig Ray Ray J H A H A H A laughing all the way to the bank. I spray flames. They cannot tame a play cake. The monster. You get in my way. I'm a feed you to the monster. I'm normal during the day, but at night turn to a monster. When the moon shines like ice bro. Wait a minute. What kind of monster is he? I think I might know. He said, "Okay, by the way, can I tell you? I like the fact that Juice's um, voice is doing the chorus there. Monster, you get in my way." I'm a feed you to the monster. I'm normal during the day, but at night turn into a monster. So the monster that's normal during the day at at night, and they said something about a moon. So he's a werewolf. He's a werewolf. Yeah, he's a werewolf. Wait, okay, guys, Ice Road Truckers. That was like this really cool reality show that was on like in America it was on like the history channel I think and it was about like uh people men and women that drove like giant um tractor trailers like rigs carrying all kinds of heavy stuff along like in Alaska like along these really or it, maybe Canada it might have been Canada um crazy roads where like they could die and it was like really they'd get stuck they'd fall over it was a crazy show, and I remember Ice Road Truckers, so I look like a villain out of those blockbusters, Godzilla, Fire spit, Spitter, Monster. Okay, guys, I'm getting it. I have to pause every verse, but we're doing it. Oh, that wasn't good. Okay, I is it bad that I know what all this stuff is? Risperdal is, it's a psychiatric medicine. I'm not exactly positive what it does, but I think it does combat like schizophrenia or like voices. Um, but yeah, Risperdal. <laughs> My fist is balled back up against the wall, pencil drawn. This is just the song to go ballistic on. Dude, you got, he is going ballistic. This is, this is amazing. Like I said, I've heard the song before, but I've never really listened to it. Like, I just know the beat. But now that I'm slowing it down and I'm reading it, it's amazing. Back up against the wall, pencil drawn. This is just the song to go ballistic on. You just pull the pistol on the guy with the missile launcher. I'm just a Loch Ness, the mythological. Quick to tell a bitch go off like a fifth of vodka. When you twist the top of the bottle, I'm a monster. You get in my way, I'm a monster. is amazing. I'm normal during the day, but at night turn to a monster. When the moon shines like ice road truckers. I look like a villain that is. Okay, that's a little American saying. I don't know if they say it anywhere else. But there's a little saying. Um, kids say it. Like, little kids will say it. will say, liar, liar, pants on fire. Um, that's so funny. Like, a liar's pants, I'm on fire. Liar, liar, pants on fire. That's an American saying. Oh. I'm actually getting this one, guys. I'm on fire and I got no plans to retire And I'm still the man you would admire I only get more handsome and flyer. I got them passing out like what you do when you hand someone flyers. And what goes around comes around. Okay, first of all, it is true. He is getting more handsome as he gets older. I didn't really care for him when he was younger. Um, but now I feel like he looks a little bit more mature looking. Um, but this is really good. I got him passing out like what you do when you hand someone flyers. You're passing out flyers. And they are passing out. And what goes around comes around just like the blades of a on a chainsaw. Genius. Just like the blades on the chainsaw. Cause I caught the flag, but my dollar stack right off the bat like a baseball. Like kidding, bitch. I got them racks with so much ease that they call me Diddy. Cause I make bands and I call Giddy. Did he just call out Diddy? Y'all know there's like there's been a beef with Diddy. And what is this? Let me play it right there. <laughs> 
kidding, bitch, I got them racks with so much e Cause I caught the flap of my dollar stack right off the bat like a baseball. Like Kid Ink. Kid Ink. Who's Kid Ink? Bitch, ooh, I got them racks with so much ease that they call me Diddy. Is that mean? Because like Diddy makes, okay, I do, I feel like Diddy just makes all kinds of money, but I really don't know what he does anymore. Like when, when I was younger, you know, he was, he made music and then he had like those reality shows and all, but like, I feel like he just has like gets money from everything. He's got clothing, all that, but like, you really don't know. So is he saying that he's got them racks? I think racks is money, right? With so much ease, they call him Diddy. But I feel like that wouldn't really be an insult. So I'm not sure about that, guys. Caught me with that. He's a they call me Diddy because I make bands and I call getting cheese a cakewalk. Yeah. Bitch, I'm a player. I'm too motherfucking stingy for shit. Okay, I should have stopped that right before I did that. Listen. Because I make bands and I call getting cheese a cakewalk cheesecake. Okay, I don't know about the cakewalk cheesecake, but I make bands. That's what Diddy did when, uh, like, I don't know, like 15 years ago or 20 years ago. Um, he used to have reality shows and he used to make bands and there was actually one of them that I actually did like, um, but yeah, he made bands. So that's, he's talking about him. I'm a player. I'm too stingy for Cher. Okay. I know who Cher is, but I'm too stingy. Oh, oh my God. I just got it. Stingy to share for Cher. Like he can't, he's too stingy, so he doesn't want to share, but share as in the artist from like the 70s and the 80s. If I can turn back time. That one, but that's not from the 80s. That's from like the late 90s. It's either 99 or 2000 because it was like my song that year. I just, if I, I used to blast that in my room with my little CD player. I love that song, guys. Okay. I'm a player, I'm too motherfucking stingy for share. Won't even lend you an ear, ain't even pretending to care. But I tell a bitch I'm Mary of Shabaria, face of my genital area. The original Richard Ramirez, Christian Rivera, cause my lyrics never sit well, so they wanna give me the chair. Like a paraplegic, and it's scary, call it Harry Carry, cause every time I'm digging Harry Carry, I'm Mary, a motherfucking dictionary. I'm swearing up and down, they can spit the shit's hilarious. It's time to put these bitches in the obituary column. We wouldn't see eye to eye with a staring problem, get the shaft like a staring column. Drink a happy pack, heat, but it's black ink, evil half of the bad meats. Evil that means take a back seat, take a back to fat beats with a maxi single. Look at my rap sheet, what attracts these people is my gangster bitch, like a patchy with a catchy jiggle. I stack chips, you better got a half eat cheeto. Fill him with the venom and eliminate him. Other words, I'm enemy. I don't wanna hurt him, but I did him in a fit rage. I murder it again. Nobody will have been a fit. I kill him and dump the fucking bodies in the lake. Obliterating everything is generated. Renegade him and make anybody who wanted with the pin and frame. Don't nobody want it, but they're gonna get it anyway. I'm beginning to feel like I'm mentally ill. I'm a killer, killer, be killer, be killer, be the vanilla gorilla. You're bringing a killer with me out of me. You don't wanna be the enemy of the demon who enemy. I'm being the receiving enemy. What's the pity? Enemy, every bit of me's the epitome of a spitter when I'm in the vicinity. Motherfucker, you better duck and you finna be dead the minute you're an enemy. A hundred percent of you was a fifth of a percent of me. Motherfucker, finish you, bitch. I'm available. You wanna battle? I'm available. I'm blowing up like an inflatable. I'm undebatable. I'm unavoidable. I'm unavoidable. I'm on the toilet wall. I got a trailer full of money and I'm paid full. I'm not afraid to pull them. Man, stop. Look what I'm planning. <laughs> okay. Oh, guys. I wasn't even going to stop during that because the only thing I was going to say about that was how freaking talented he is to be able to say all that so clearly. Like I could literally, you know, hear each word, but it was too much for me to put it together to like, you know, say anything about it. But just the fact that he is talented enough to say all those words, that's mind blowing. Honestly, just mind blowing. Um, that is absolutely crazy. And Juice World, like seriously, he had the perfect part. Like his voice complimented the rap amazingly. And yeah, that was amazing. And I can't believe I didn't do this one earlier, guys. I really don't. All right, guys, I hope I did well with that one. I, like I said, I wasn't going to try the end, but I caught a lot of stuff in that one. So I'm a little... Let's be proud for me. All right, guys, if you have any recommendations, drop them in the comments. I'm going to try to do at least one Juice World a day and then something else, something newer or something Moroccan because I want to re um, react to more Moroccan. If you guys don't know, I'm going to Hoba Hoba Spirit this Saturday in Rabat, and I will be doing a whole video um, getting ready, going. I'm going with a friend, and we're going to have dinner. And then we're going to go to the show and it's all going to be recorded. It's going to be a great, great video. And this is, this is a Moroccan band that is a mix of like whatever, like their music is here, but then also like rock, punk, lots of instruments. It's going to be, it's like a mix of so much. And 
it's really, I'm really, really excited. I started listening to a couple of their songs. One of the songs I, I know, I mean, I don't know all the words, but like, I know this one, right? The other ones I'm starting to, um, listen to them during the day so I can be ready for them on Saturday. But I hope you'll come in and hopefully I'll get that posted on Sunday. I want to get that up right away. But, um, if you guys are not subscribed and you're like literally listening to this 15 minute video, hit that subscribe button. It makes it so much easier. Also, also turn on notifications. I don't ever say that. And I think that is very important to say. Turn on notifications and you'll never miss anything. And if you're not following me on IG, please, please, Mama4Reacts. And um, I'll see you over there. Bye, guys.